Konnichiwa, this is the Shogunstein. And this is some initial torts and an overview of a pair of wireless earbuds, wireless headset from Bass Pal, which is a brand I'm sure everyone has heard of, Bass Pal. So they're wireless uh, headset, U1. And here is what they look like. Comes with a nice little uh, charging case. They charge it pretty quickly. This is the earbud. They got like a little button. And they run about $40 on Amazon uh, for these earbuds, which is inexpensive, fairly for an earbud. You know, obviously that's more expensive than a dollar store earbud, but it's a lot cheaper than, say, uh, Dr. Snoop Beats or uh, the Boise, um, you know, like the sound uh, noise cancellation. In the interest of full disclosure, Amazon did send us a pair of these wireless headset earbuds for review purposes. So just to be uh, transparent, they did send us a pair of these earbuds. So again, um, earbuds, you know, if you got your Ipid or maybe you got your phone and you listen to like me, I got the streaming, I got the Pandorify, Tidal, XM streaming stuff. And, uh, you know, you got to listen to your music. I got to listen to my Lord Huron. I got to listen to my Need to Breathe. Got to listen to my uh, Mumford and Sons. So I need to have a good pair of earbuds, especially when, uh, you know, I'm running or I'm doing a workout or I'm on a go ruck, listening to a uh, podcast. Maybe I'm listening to Jocko podcast or Joe Rogan podcast or Lex Friedman podcast. So I need a good pair of earbuds, one of the ones that are waterproof and hold a good charge. At the same time, the Dr. Snoops can be pretty expensive. So these run 40 bucks and they're showing double Earring stereo, 50 hours of long play time, smart quick uh, matching. You get uh, two times two wireless headsets. So I'm hoping, you know, you normally need two. That's stereo. It's like my friend Michael. He's got a TV with surround sound. Um, you got the charging case. You got your uh, silicon uh, earplugs. You got your USB cable. You have a little user manual. So... We get a lot of electronics to try out from Amazon Vine, and very often they are from companies, usually based in China, that we've never heard of. So again, I don't know who Bass Pal is, and that's been the case with a lot of electronics they've sent us. And what's interesting is some of the electronics they've sent us, I've actually seen, whether it be other earbuds or a camera, you know, or even some wearable, like some, uh, you know, fake Fitbits. I've seen this clearly the same earbud, clearly the same camera with like five different company names. So I really don't know who Bass Pal is. I don't know if there's another version of these. So they're 40 bucks. And uh, I got to be honest with you, um, they're pretty good. You know, I've uh, used them on uh, Go Rucks. I've used them uh, running, used them on the, the rowing machine, used it doing some... Uh, you know, box jumps and other things in, in the workout. And uh, they stay in my ear. They haven't, uh, that was a very good thing. You know, they didn't move it and have to adjust them. And, uh, you know, I, I sweat a lot, especially, you know, when you're out on a ruck and it's, you know, 110 degrees outside. Um, certainly sweat and the, certainly the, the waterproof has been fine. And they're actually very comfortable. They've been very uh, comfortable to, to wear and, uh, you know, didn't have any problems with, you know, my ear or them hurting my ear. So in the in the pluses, you know, for 40 bucks, you're getting a comfortable pair of, of earbuds that didn't fall out. Now, the biggest criticism that I would have was I felt the sound was a, a little low. I didn't think they went. Uh, I would have liked them a little louder. I like mine to go up to 11. So. They could have, especially on uh, like the podcast, you know, I was listening to, to Rogan today or, you know, Jocko the other day. Um, it only goes so loud. So the sound is very clear. The sound on these is very, for $40, the sound has been very good. But it's just been maybe a tiny bit too low. The other issue I've had is the button, this little control button here for the volume is a little uh, inconsistent. So I've had uh, some, I don't want to say issues, but, uh, you know, one of the things that's been a little bit problematic is using the button to adjust the volume. 
and there's certain you're supposed to press it once for the volume, once to the right for up and left to, to down. That's really been the only issue I've had in terms of the mechanics is just this button is a little tricky and uh, I just wish they were a little louder. Um, they charge very quickly. They hold the charge. Um, they claim to be noise cancellation and they're not. I don't feel that they're noise cancel. In fact, I think that the amount of sound it lets in is actually a good balance because I like to not be totally uh, silent to what's going around, especially if I'm outside or, um, uh, you know, when I'm walking around, you know, especially if you're outside, maybe you want to make sure you can hear traffic or, you know, you want to hear if there's a car coming. So it doesn't completely uh, block out the sound like some other things do, which I also like because on some of the, the noise cancellation stuff, when you're you're running, you hear that thump, 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 thump. And I don't get that with this. So again, because they're not overly loud, you do get some some background noise, but I think it's at a, at a good level. I don't like ones that are like too much noise cancellation. So would I take these on a plane? Maybe not because again, the volume doesn't get as high as I would like and they aren't noise cancellation, but certainly for outdoor activity, I've liked them. So overall for 40 bucks, I think they're a, a good pair of, of uh, earbuds. Um, on my, my Rucks, um, the sound has been very nice. It's, uh, you know, again, no problem with, with uh, sweat and, uh, you know, I'm getting a little little wet from the, the sweat. And, and most importantly, very, very comfortable. You know, I've left them in my ear for a while and they stay in and I don't have to, once they're in, I don't have to adjust it and they don't hurt my, my ear at all. And, uh, you know, I'm listening to my Lord Euron and it sounds great. Just maybe I wish it was a little louder. So for 40 bucks, they're a good pair of headphones. Um, again, I don't know much about this company, Bass Pal. Never heard of them. But again, you know, if you're going to get a, you know, a Dr. Drake for, you know, $300, the Dr. Drake Beats, yeah, that's a, you know, you're spending $300 on a pair of headphones, you know, they better be like the, like you're at a concert. It better be like I'm at the, the Van Buren or the Marquee here in uh, Phoenix. Um, but for $40, quite happy with them. And uh, they're going to be my go-to headphones for, for a while. Except for maybe uh, if the planes from, from Luke Air Force Base are flying over and I'm going to my ruck, then maybe I need something that goes a tiny bit louder. But a uh, nice pair of earbuds, $40. I think you're getting a, a, a good deal. And maybe, maybe it's just my hearing. Maybe I'm just getting old and my, my hearing's going. And maybe that's why it doesn't seem as loud to, to me because I got, you know, 49-year-old ears. But uh, nice, uh, nice pair of headphones. So uh, certainly a good value at $40. Again, don't know much about Bass Pal, but uh, they make a pretty good uh, pair of budget uh, earbuds that are comfortable, good enough sound. Uh, the Bluetooth, oh, that's the other thing. These paired, one, two, three. Sometimes I get these earbuds and it's a pain to pair them. This was uh, no problem with the, the pairing at uh, all. So uh, good pair of budget headphones, you know, if you're worried, you know, in, in my, my side gig, you know, sometimes people need headphones in those side gigs and sometimes they can easily get stolen or lost. A number of times I found the, you know, uh, you know, a little case with the, the ear pod, you know, under a desk, you know, if they're bringing in, you know, $200 earbuds, you know, and you lose them, you know, you don't want to be out 200 bucks. So again, and maybe in that kind of situation, maybe you want a you know cheaper pair of, of earbuds. You know, again, you're out and about, and uh, you just don't want to be walking around with that much money worth of, of earbud. So if you're looking for a, a good budget earbud, then I think you could uh, you'll do pretty well with these Bass Pal wireless headset. So this is the Shogunstein. I'm gonna go listen to some more Jocko, some more Joe Rogan, some more uh, Need to Breathe. This is the Shogunstein out.